Well, it may seem like an image from a bygone era. A doctor walking up to the front door, black bag in hand, to check on a patient in their home. Well, in today's medical report, Tampa Tribune reporter Chloe Cabrera introduces us to a local doctor that makes house calls a regular part of his practice. Hey, Mr. Peck. Sorry to keep it's checkup time for Howard Peck, and he doesn't have to drive across town or wait in a doctor's office. That's because this doctor comes to see him. Once a week, dermatologist Seth Foreman closes his Carrollwood practice to make house calls. Peck is one of 20 patients he regularly visits at the Emeritus Assisted Living Facility in Carrollwood. We're serving a need that's really, really important in our in our in our nation he travels with the old tools of the trade but he also keeps tabs on his patients um, with today's technology he can draw blood do minor skin biopsies and other procedures outside the office I think it is um, kind of like the days where they grew up where the physicians visited them in their homes and made house calls I think it takes them back to yesteryear. Foreman says seeing patients at home makes them more relaxed and it also allows him to look for subtle signs of illness that can be caught early. His house call was a lifesaver for Howard Peck. Dr. Foreman took a biopsy of a sore behind his ear that turned out to be skin cancer. It's one of those things in this case I would have put it off. I just said, oh well, so what's there. Uh, the uh, another provider I went to said it, it'll go away. But but sores don't go away. So, yeah, I was real happy he came out. Besides the obvious rewards of treating patients in need, Dr. Foreman finds satisfaction in providing a service that helps reduce health care costs. The most important thing to do is not to delay a diagnosis. If we wait until there's a huge problem, the patients usually need more expensive, more aggressive treatment. With the Tampa Tribune, I'm Chloe Cabrera for News Channel 8. Our time right now, 513. Storm